in a dark time when hope was bleak. There lived a young girl whose only escape was in a legend that wanted her back. The legend speaks of the lost soul of a princess from another world who will one day be reborn. There will be signs that mark her return. There will be secrets that reveal her destiny. There will be a journey that will make you believe. Will you deliver Spain from bondage? Take this ring. It is a symbol of your pledge to find the elixir of immortality. I'll wear it when you find Eden. And when you return, I shall be your Eve. Is everything all right? Everything's all right. How's she doing? She had a seizure. Wait, I'm afraid. It's been progress at work. My conquistador, always conquering. We tested the substance. There's hope. Your wife needs you. So what are you up to tonight? We're going to this party tonight, this warehouse thing. Some sort of rave thing. Is this gonna be cool? Just sit back and watch. I understand it's party time, it's gonna be huge. It's gonna be a kick-ass time. Columbia Pictures invites you. You shouldn't do this, Rana. To a new kind of night on the town. <laughs> I think I feel something. Give it a gun! Are you a virgin? What? Wow, bang, surprise. No. Yo, man, I told you, my mother's mother's mother was black. Mother, if you were woman? any less black, you would be clear. Oh, Shut up! Get ready for the year's hippest, edgiest comedy. You stole a car, shot a bouncer, and had sex with two women. Oh, yeah, that will define the generation. It really didn't go as bad as it could have. Ah! Is your British ass happy now? Go. So. Hmm, what are we doing tomorrow? The goal of this thing is to exterminate life. So what you're telling me, Father, there's nothing that can stop this. There is only one thing. Okay. This woman is mankind's most precious possession. She is perfect. Major Dallas, I've been selected for a mission of the utmost importance. What mission? 
save the world. <laughs> business this guy comes to town every tuesday are you free tuesday yeah i'm free tuesday you can't stop what you can't see this guy came from the outside he was a pro he was fast in the art of the kill leon was the master somebody's coming up somebody's serious he never missed a hit he never got caught. You're indestructible. Bullets slide off you. You play with them. And above all else, he never had a reason to care. Until now. I like these calm little moments before the storm. My family was shot down by DEA officers. Three kids here. One of them is missing. Find her. He's opened the door. a very good observer, Cole. We have a very advanced program, something very different. An opportunity to reduce your sentence considerably. And possibly play an important role in returning the human race to the surface of the Earth. No license, no prints, no warrants. What he took on five cops like he was just into the eyeballs. What year is this? What year do you think it is? 1996. That's the future, James. Do you think you're living in the future? I am simply trying to gather information to help the people in the present trace the path of the virus. We're not in the present now. This is a place for crazy people. I'm not saying you're not mentally ill. I'm for all I know, you're <coughs> crazy as a loon. The army of the 12 monkeys, they're the ones that spread the virus. Monkeys? He's been living in a meticulously constructed fantasy world, and that world is starting to disintegrate. You haven't become addicted to that dying world? No, sir. He needs help. You think I'm crazy when people start dying next month? I don't belong here. You're here because of the system. I know some things that you don't know. <laughs> yes, my son. You sent me to the wrong year. You're certain of that? Science ain't an exact science. You had a bullet from World War One in your leg, James. How did it get there? I don't know. You're a trained psychiatrist. You know the difference between what's real and what's not. You said that I had delusions. You said you could explain. I'm trying to. I want the future to be unknown. I can help you. Get you out. Monkeys. The thing mutates. We live underground. They're watching you. I just want to do my part to get us back on top in charge of the planet. Tell me who he is. He's, uh... He was my best friend.
money wasn't. There was nothing. They took it. You expect me to believe that a flying saucer came down and took your friend away to outer space? My brother, Mike. What you guys do with him? This town's going nuts. Everything's crazy. There are those of us out there who know the truth. They were two young girls living in a world of imagination. I'm going to the fourth world. It's an absolute paradise of music, art, and pure enjoyment. What they had was friendship. What a disgrace you are. Your mother is rather a miserable woman. What they needed was freedom. Do you like your mother? No. What they shared was a secret. Your daughter's been behaving in a rather disturbed manner. What's she done? I think I'm going crazy. I'm sure it's perfectly innocent. <laughs> the crime that shocked the nation. People die every day. Only the best people fight against all obstacles in pursuit of happiness. Paul thought it up. Aren't you clever? We're not going to be separated. <laughs> I hate She's uncontrollable. Based on a true story. It's all frightfully romantic. Heavenly Creatures. She picked him clean. He never missed him. Remember that sting experience? How good you felt? Now, the sting. Winner of seven Academy Awards, including Best Picture, is back. Chicago was the place to be in 1936. In those days, the big con was a dying art. Until a first-class grifter on the lam from the FBI and a young gaffer from Joliet joined forces to con the Big Mick. He's not as tough as he thinks. Neither are we. Paul Newman is Henry Gondorf. There wasn't a con he couldn't run. And there wasn't a sucker he couldn't gaff. Robert Redford is Johnny Hooker, a young grifter with plenty of moxie. Three grand on the red, Jimmy. But he's a sucker for lady luck. Tough luck, kid. And a sap for lady love. Thanks for the big evening, Hooker. Oh, Next time you want to spend 50 bucks on me, mail it. Come on, Robert Shaw is the mark. In the underworld, he's the big Mick. Name's Lonergan. Dial Lonergan. It starts with the setup. You owe me 15 grand, pal. <laughs> then you bait the hook. Your boss is quite a card player, Mr. Kelly. How does he do it? He cheats. You play him on the wire. The wire's been out of date for 10 years. That's why he won't know it. Now he's ready for the sting. There, let's get on it. Come on, Listen to me. Don't go back to your place tonight. Five hundred thousand dollars to win. Lucky Dan. Paul Newman and Robert Redford. This time they might get away with it.